Hello, welcome to Pythian TV. I'm Johnny. Tonight we want to talk a little bit about different tank technologies. One of the most common out there that many of you have and many of you use is called a wick tank. Take a look there, get a little close up on that. You can see the long strings that run through it. They soak up the liquid, the liquid hangs in the middle, electricity goes through and, and air passes and you have vapor. They're fine, they, they work well. I use them for all our testers. Uh, we sell them on our starter kits. And for starting out, they're great. They're just, I find they're inconsistent. You set them down for the night, uh, you set them down for any length of period, and the one side tends to dry out. When you go to hit that, a lot of times you'll get a dry cotton hit. Uh, for lack of a better phrase, I call it wicky. There's just no other word for it. So a step up from that is the coil tank. This is the Kanger T3S. Kanger is our tank of choice. Uh, we also deal with the Pro Tank, which is the reason we deal with these is because they're so much more consistent, so much more often. So a coil, let me show you this. Now it mounts from the bottom as well, but it sits at the bottom. Screws right into the rear. Now take a close look at this. You see there's a little bit of that wick right there, a little bit of wick right there flowing through, saturates with liquid, but it's much, much more condensed than the wick is. What does that mean? It means it tends to stay saturated longer and better and gives you a more consistent hit each time. And that's really what's important is that when you're going to vape, that it has to be consistent each time you do it. Otherwise, you may end up not sticking with it. So, Again, our tank of choice is the coil tank. Uh, our manufacturer of choice is Kanger. And when you start out, the CE4 is a great place to start. But if you want to step up and have a much more consistency, we'll always recommend going to a coil tank. So, thank you very much. Come back and see us.